Hey guys, welcome back. So this week we're going to be looking at one of the most prolific producers in house music, and that is Sweely, and specifically the bass lines which make his tracks just so you know danceable and popular. Uh, he uses uh, an FM bass for quite a lot of his tracks, including uh, If You're Happy With Me. Um, I think that's the name of the track. Only If You're Happy, I think that's the name of the track. And uh, yeah, we'll be kind of recreating that and showing you how to make that in Ableton. Okay, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so this is the sound that we're going to be making. I'm sure you'll recognize the bass line as the one from Only If You're Happy. Now the key to this type of bass line is frequency modulation. So let's load up operator. You'll notice that with just one oscillator the patch is super subby, as we've basically only got one sine wave playing. But when we introduce a second sine wave with the oscillator B, we start to get a more recognisable sound of the FM bass. Let's bring back oscillator A to be the same level as B and turn off the filter. Next, let's bring the sustain on A right down and increase the decay to 6 seconds. Now let's do the same for oscillator B whilst also increasing its attack up to 1 millisecond. It's already sounding tonally there, let's just amp it up with some effects. I find the pedal effect is great for bass lines and it's a quick way to really alter the sound of your bass. Let's turn on its sub function and set it to distort to introduce some more low end to the sound whilst tweaking the bass, mid and treble settings to get a sound we're happy with. Now to introduce some more harmonics with the saturator preset hot tubes to warm up our low ends. Finally, an auto filter cutting off just the very high end of the bass and boosting the frequencies around there. You can hear when I drag the frequency around a bit, it introduces some interesting character to our bass, should we want it. Listening to Only If You're Happy, I think Sweely has some glide on his bass, so let's go ahead and apply that too, although I think the patch sounds great with and without it. And there you go, here's the bass line alongside some elements from the track, very quickly and very shoddily put together by myself. Enjoy! So that's the video, I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something from that, learned a little bit about how to make an FM bass like Sweely and maybe other artists like Gene on Earth and also maybe how to apply some of the tips that we've used in this video to your own bass lines to improve them as well. Uh, as I always say, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, it really helps the channel out on our push to 5k subscribers and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.